sold out crowd at Tapestry came together to inspire women in our community. This year's keynote speaker, award-winning TV anchor and correspondent Elizabeth Vargas, opened up about her personal struggles. Wayne 15 Sierra Tufts joins us live now from the newsroom with more. Sierra? Dirk and Tara, I had the chance to speak with Elizabeth one-on-one -on -one before she spoke with the crowd at Memorial Coliseum. Her message, you are not alone. It wasn't until I graduated from college and began working my very first job in television in Reno, Nevada, that I learned the powerful seduction of a glass of wine. In front of hundreds at Tapestry, Elizabeth Vargas shared her experience turning to alcohol. That glass of wine had a profound effect on my anxiety and on my raging insecurity that I wasn't talented enough or good enough. Seemingly living a perfect life as a network anchor, behind the scenes, Vargas struggled with anxiety and alcoholism. You look at people and you make a lot of assumptions about what their life must be like. And, oh, it looks so easy, so it must be so easy. And the fact of the matter is that's not true. Vargas says she always knew she had anxiety but bottled it up until it ran over and she washed it down with bottles of wine. And I didn't seek help was because I thought I was the only one. Um, and there is such a stigma around addiction in this country, which is why it's become a public health emergency. Sponsored by Purdue for Wayne and Parkview Health, Tapestry is meant to renew, educate, and inspire women in all stages of life. Vargas believes by talking about the lows in her life, she can help educate and inspire women to open up about mental health issues in their own lives. The more we can talk about it and more, the more people hear that People they might see on television and think life is so easy for her, guess what, it, it wasn't, you know, it wasn't. And um, I would have been a lot better off if I had somebody to talk to about it. Vargas ended her speech by opening up the floor to questions and being even more candid. Live in the newsroom, Sierra Tufts, Wayne 15 News. Sierra, thanks.